Peter. In the campus, they ask many times about the four phases of direct light. When did this happen in the past, before the appearance of our world, or is it happening right now? Uh, in the campus, you should say you don't have a choice. You should say it happened once in the beginning of creation, and it exists until today. And through these, uh, all the, uh, the prinot, through all these prinot, light comes to us and uh, sustains us. Santiago, Santiago. Uh, for two questions, please. The first one, why do we sometimes talk about Prinot and sometimes about Sfirot? What's the difference between them? Prinot, uh, we talk about the four Prinot, four phases of direct light. And Sfirot means that the four phases of direct light are after this in Tzum, and the Masach, and the Ochozer, and the Kelim begin to work in sympathizing and becoming similar to the light. The four Prinot don't sympathize with the light, don't identify with the light. They are extended from above downward. Afterwards, all the work, uh, after the restriction, are the hanging down of the worlds and all that. This is already work from below upward. And then we talk about Sfirot. A Sfira is a will to receive after the Tzimtzum, the Masach, and Or Chazer, when it begins to shine to the extent of its equivalence with the light, according to the law of equivalence of form. Give. Give. 